Good morning, everyone. I'm going camping. So I'm off to Mountain Sanctuary Park, which is about two hours from here. Uh, I'm going to drive through now. Should get there by about uh, mid-afternoon and probably take a hike and then the camp going, get a fire started. at uh, Mountain Sanctuary Park and I'm going to set up the camp. So the sanctuary or mountain sanctuary park as it's called, uh, it's really dead, it's midweek, uh, not a lot going on here, but it's the perfect time for just a little bit of peace and quiet, um, taking a little break, putting our feet up and uh, just enjoying peace and quiet of nature. Last night around the fire, we up early and we're heading off for a little hack to the rock pools.
absolutely freezing. So we've had a nice little swim um, by the pools and we're just hiking back to our camp, gonna pack up and go get a coffee. Should be a great way to end uh, the midweek adventure. All packed up and ready to hit the road. First thing, grab some coffee. These are my rules for camping. One, you leave the campsite the way you found it. You don't leave any litter. You most certainly don't leave any food because there's monkeys to eat it. And you make sure that you put your fire out. Two is you um, make sure you've got plenty of firewood and something to keep the fire going to get it started and the whole thing. There's nothing worse than running out of firewood and there's no way to go get wood in the middle of the night. Three is have some shade. It's hot, really hot, and there's nowhere to hide from the sun. So you've got to make sure you've got a large umbrella, some sort of an awning, something. Sitting in your tent is not a solution for the heat out in the bush. Four, four lots of uh, water. You have to be able to hydrate, you have to be able to clean, and you have to be able to extinguish fire if, uh, if anything catches a light or when you want to go to sleep, you want to put the fire out, you normally need water. Something warm with you. The weather can change pretty quickly late at night and even though you're sitting around a fire, it can get chilly pretty fast and you don't want to get cold. Six, I'd say, is you need some sort of bug repellent. I personally use a nice cream, peaceful sleep, and I also highly recommend you get these wristbands that keep the mosquitoes away. Um, and they really work. They, they not just gimmicky, they actually do work. The nice thing about them is they also glow in the dark. So at night time when things are pitch black, it's nice to be able to see people that are all wearing these bands. You can see each other, know each other. Seven lighting you've got to always carry a small little torch on you or something so that if you go to the toilet in the middle of the night you're not fumbling around hitting into trees and things like that eight make sure that you have some sort of a raincoat or something because it can rain out of nowhere and you need to pack stuff up pretty quickly and nine is at night time make sure you pack everything up to put things inside your tent and put things away um, so as to not attract any animals uh, to your camp. There's nothing worse than waking up in the morning and the monkeys are kind of ripping everything apart, uh, digging in dustbins that you haven't closed and the whole thing. So you need to definitely you know, put stuff away properly. 10, what would be 10? Respecting other people and where you are. And that is, you know, keep the noise to a minimum. Um, don't be shining torches all over the place. It's very disruptive. And people are out there for a little bit of peace. So I think that if you can just try and be a little mannered, um, appreciate the beauty of being outdoors and the silence, uh, you're gonna have a really great time. So grab some coffee, time to hit the road. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, leave a comment and stay cool.